What's good, yo? We back, RTTV. Okay. And if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill murder and smash that subscribe button. And welcome back to RTTV. We react to everything. 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 We're here for the finale of Hell's Paradise. Hell's Paradise. Yeah. Bust Hell's Paradise. He got it. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. So. Last episode, we learned that these uh these Tan, what are they called? The Ten? The Tan, right? The Tenzin. Yeah, they have. They they also lied about this whole religion that these people on this mm -hmm. island were worshiping, right? This, this tree dude, mm -hmm. his whole family was lost and sacrificed to just their energy source. Damn. You know? And he just went out and just told them like that. So pretty much. <laughs> oh, no. they told you that? We've been telling y'all dumb out after yeah. so long. <laughs> I don't know whether to laugh or cry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We also see Jerry's favorite character. Yeah. The one that, you know, he called fat and said, you know what, he was gonna, you know, he was gonna die. The, the weakest, the weakest the character Tenga. of the three, that's Tenga? what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Right? The, the one, one that, that you call, the one that you call fat. I didn't call fat because that's not what I, I said. Call him fat. Yo, nah, you said you said I because he's fat, fat, he's timid. That's crazy. I didn't say the yeah. words fat. Listen, I just he's the weakest character. Yo, I'm judging the book by his cover. But it's not because of the cover. <laughs> but, but like, but then I'm like, deeper like, than the cover. Like, but then I'm like, but then I'm like, but then I'm like, but then I'm like, I came back and I was like, yo, I didn't mean it like that. You feel me? Okay. Like, I, I used the wrong choice of wording. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But he's the weakest. He knew what he's he was like, like, ah, damn. He's the weakest. Of, he's, he's the weakest of the three. Cancel That's the point, man. Watch out. Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, shout shout out to y'all in the comments. Y'all rock with me, Shout me down. All my life. <laughs> All right, well, <laughs> let's see how we survive this one in this finale. I expect it to be a great one. And they already announced that season two was coming. Yes. Oh, it's it got to be great, though. Yeah, that. So, it was a great run. It was a great run, House Paradise. We loved it, and we can't wait to see more. Chases. If you guys want to watch the full reaction to these episodes and the rest of season one, you can check it out on our Patreon. The link's down below in the description. Dreams and reality. That's also opposite. Mm. You feel me? Umbrella and ink. Yeah, yeah. You didn't need me to figure that one out for y'all. <laughs> Uh, Let's do it. Blind man just came through and set it off right now. That umbrella and ink analogy was phenomenal. It's like you're, you're I haven't understand it before. Blind man! Yeah. Blind man! Blind man, blind man. Now we're about to see the results of his trade arc. Bro, look at that. This is what you can see. You can see the ton, bro. Oh, okay. He got it, bro. He's been testing his blade. And we said it, uh, he was going to be nasty with this once he fixed it out. Quick, quick. That shook. Oh, he's alive. You know why? Because he, he had the weakest link, baby. He's not, he's not the strongest of the three guys. Damn, he could take him. Oh, Oh, he's gone, man. Let's go, a new main character. Oh. Bro, he's spazzing. Yeah, he's going crazy. With our eyes, I can do this. He's definitely not the weakest leg. Mmm. Give me that. Oh. oh. The slash was so crazy, it pushed him back. Oh, uh, yeah, you can see he's whooping his eyes right now. It's not regenerating. She owns a beast. Oh, that thing's talking. Oh, whoa! Oh, How that happen? I'm, I'm not gonna lie, that flower thing is really creepy. Wow. Damn, what that tastes like? Flowers? Nah, he's lit. I don't want him to die. He's dying. Yeah, 
<laughs> I got it in me, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. Why don't you do that? that? Maybe she's like... What is it like, the passing of Tao? Th- maybe because she's female. Maybe she has the opposite Tao of him or something like that. The same way they were talking about uh, Shorty. Yeah. Oh. That's all day. Oh, damn. Sigiri oh. with the flares. Oh, she's moving. Oh. She got significantly better, huh? Yeah, right? Since she built it. <coughs> oh. Mm-hmm. Hi, Sagi. Well, actually, she ain't nasty, too. Dead. Yeah, they all had to get stronger to be able to survive on this island. That's what it is. Oh Ooh, my god. Oh. Yeah, he's better than Luke Skywalker. Let's go. Oh, damn. Yeah. Come right through. Mm. Mm. Cut him down to size, sir. I mean, his life is on the line, that's why. There's nobody to give him a blood transfusion. Boy, you did to my homie. Alright, go ahead. Blackout! Come he's on, going man. Super yeah. Saiyan 10. He's going Ultra Ooh. Instinct. That's what he's going. Yeah! Oh. Yes! The play well! Get him! Get him! Go! Follow your gut then, bro. Oh, he's still up. He's still up, Jay! There it is. Go crazy! Go! Go! Oh! I'm the weakest link! I told you where to hit him! Ew, there it is! Did you see, like, it's all versions of him? Wow, wow. Perfect. I don't want him to die, though. So, yeah, he said, I've never Ooh. seen perfect yin yang, bro. He's li- He literally reached the peak of using tongue. Yo. Nah, well, he's like that. Well, I was just like saying that. some stuff like right that. there. Yo, he was able to get to that peak level because he was at the balance of life and death. That's exactly. the biggest, like, dichotomy and opposites you can get, bro. She was like, she was real. Yeah. Wow. That's tough. I like that perspective, though. Like a lot, she made dying very sound peaceful for this dude right here. Yeah, yeah. she's like, you ain't gotta lie no more, bro. Look at this is how he's this is how he's passing away right here, bro. Tears in his eyes. Sagiri <laughs> number one. <laughs> <laughs> See the damn, my boy is changing. Yeah. He's using these things to direct them. You saw that? She doesn't exist. Wow. 
That's not his wife isn't real. Oh wow, that's Whoa. crazy. Nah, you know it's, that's why I was thinking bro. that because they were saying like memory manipulation and consciousness. I'm like, damn. So does that mean like they could just make you think anything? So you was searching for someone to get back to that never existed. Man, she's having to read down through the towel. Like, yep, uh, there's a big piece of you missing. This is, and it was this turned head. off. This is memory. Man, they all got clapped. Third night tears. <laughs> mm hmm. His wife! That is a fire twist right there. Damn. She's not wow. there. She's not real. That's she's sick. Not, so she was like against Jitsu. Joker, yo. She was against Jitsu the whole time. The with is the pain he caused Evan. God dang, man. You understand? That's how he coped with it. That was his coping mechanism. Nah, yeah, that's how they manipulated him. Nah, that's how he manipulated him. It's not him coping, bro. Yeah, they, they, they put him in a Genji too. Because no, when they spoke cool. about when they spoke about um oh, let's see this. Jo on. Joel's favorite character. Bakugo or whatever. Who's that? I guess they're sending, yeah. they're sending more people yeah. to the Shinsenkyo. Bro, that's Which just kind of dumb because they don't really understand what's going on. Oh, season finale? Yeah, yeah season sir. finale. It's cap. <laughs> That's cat, bro. Why? He's like, why end like that? I don't know. It just didn't feel like a season finale. To me. Nah, he just wants more. Huh? That was pretty crazy, though. The ending in terms of like the like just finding out that guy Maru's like, like kind of like not existence, but his backstory was really just fictitious. But <laughs> I just don't think it's only him either. Like I think like it, it makes everything it leaves everything to question now. No, no, no. but not everybody's nah. from his village. Though. Yeah, well, yeah, um, it's just his village. They said like um. The bro, the dude that you rock with, Chube, Chube, he, cause he has that uh that the um mark growing on him. They said they could manipulate his consciousness and thoughts too. So well, it, okay, I get what you saying. They did say that. Yeah, that's because I possible. like I feel like in this place, like they they are able to in some ways be able to do something like that. But that's only because with him, he overused the towel. And exactly, he, 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 he any ate the thing. Yeah, the towel so that's why they could do that too. He has like an overconsumption of like towel for a human. So the thing is, the fact that he has that much, it makes him makes him more vulnerable. That's why the blind dude was like, yo, I can see that there's a good reason why we shouldn't use too much towel. I think Sagiri is going to mess him up later. I think Sagiri is going to be Gabi Maru's driving force to get off the island moving forward. Because it seems that he realized that he was in a Genjutsu the whole time, which is a crazy concept to control. He didn't realize it. Well, not nah, yeah, no, nah, no, I thought he because he, he, no, he like, just said that like basically he was trying to remember things. Yeah, he didn't realize that, that he they, was in a Genjutsu, but he I think he realized that his wife wasn't really his wife in that uh -huh. memory. You don't you don't think that that's that a memory? possibility? There's though. a possibility. He sat there and he was like, "Yo," he thought he was holding somebody's hand. Then he looked and he realized nobody was there. So he realized that he wasn't. I don't know if that was us or him. That was that was yeah, him. That was, I, was I, was I feel I, like that was for us because for him he just he just couldn't remember anything besides that. Yo, I'm this person from this village. That's why that's all he can remember right now. You know what I'm saying? That's why. So I don't think that to he don't necessarily. I don't think he this he disconfirmed that she's uh. Nick, uh a real thing, he just don't remember. And I that think that that's sense. why he'll still want to get to the end, to kind of figure it all out. Like, put the whole story. I get what you're saying. But, like, basically, he didn't figure out that they p implanted a, a memory of his wife there. Yeah, yeah, because at that moment, he was trying to recall his he backstory, could. but he couldn't. Yeah. And I feel like, there's a, like, that moment could be taken in two different ways in terms of, like, he could have Notice the hand, then notice it never existed, or he noticed the hand, and it, like it's just showing us that she never existed. It can be taken both ways. I think he noticed the hand, and noticed that she never existed, but no, I think that, 
I don't think, I think that you guys are right in the sense that he never, it's not that he realized he never had a wife. It's just that I think that he's starting to realize that there was something there, but it was just never there, but he just doesn't know what it was. Okay, I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, I get, I get. yeah, yeah. But I just want to see, because I think at this point, Sigiri, Sigiri has to be, if he gets some sort of memory back, because he forgot everything up to the point to where he's on the island. He doesn't remember anything that was going on the island. He just remembers where he's from and his name. I don't, I think if he gains those memories back, Sigiri's going to be his driving force again them off the island. What I do think is an interesting thing that they did with the season finale, though, is like, Gabi Mara wasn't really part of the main fight. Like, the, the last finale fight. Like, this was Shion Dono and um, Yorazuya and Sagi. Uh, Sagi. Yeah, so like, they were the ones who kind of finished off the the first tens and to get smoked out. Mm. And without Senta, we can't get that to happen. I, so I'm just like, I don't know. Like, I'm happy that like, Shion Dono, though, he seems like he's super smart and he's going to be the guy now yeah, we'll be that's good. able to figure Shion it out. Shion is like that. Shion and, um, I say his name again? Sigiri. 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 It was good to see the evolution of um, the dynamic of them fighting, meaning uh, how she got better and as she she got better with time and also the girl that um he, he saved. Like Yaruzia or something like that. Whatever. Yeah, Yaruzia. Yeah, she was able to fight now from seeing them be um, helpless to seeing them be two strong uh, females fighting. It was good to see. It was like watching um your kids grow up. They're not your kids. <laughs> so it's not like watching your kids though. My my I think my favorite thing right now is that we, everything we knew kind of just yeah, it's, it's, it's gone. Yeah, it's out the window. Like even the reason why we're here, the, like the the elixir exists, but it don't really because of what it, it does to you, and you have to con continuously consume it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So like in that aspect, it don't exist. It's a gift even, and a curse. Yeah, and we and what we learned about like even the the master in uh, Yagimaru's village, like his, what we thought his um, elixir that he took, you know, the reason why we believed it is because we thought somebody arrest already had taken it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Now we see that it could be an illusion. Well, I think it is an illusion. I right? think it's an illusion. I, I think that, it's an that, illusion. that knife through the head thing was an illusion to make him feel like, you know, not only you should intimidate and fear me and stuff like that, now you have this belief that an elixir like exists so you can try to go out there and get it. Yeah, and these are kind of the tactics that people use in this world to kind of manipulate people, maybe to even reach their full potential, like yeah. someone like Gabi Maru, you know what I'm saying? And and then the, even the twist of like, yo, um, you know, this is a way to manipulate and control you, but like, because this is the way that drives him the most, which is love, that, you know, he's actually not a bad guy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I like that twist too. Yeah, and I think, I think, Jerry, you got a good thing going in terms of, like, Sagiri might, she's going to fulfill the void. Like, because she's going to feel that something's missing, like a person that was near and dear to him. And then once he gets in the interaction with Sagiri, he's going to be like, oh, you were that person yeah. that was able to ground me and stuff like that, humble me and stuff. So that's going to be cool. Oh, yeah, Chobi's going to kill his brother. Chobi's going to kill his brother. That'll be sick. Because the thing is, since I think, so he's getting more like of the, he's losing more of himself because he took so much of that towel. I think he's gonna get to his next fight, use too much towel, the person's gonna recognize it, the is gonna recognize it, and then uh, basically manipulate his thoughts to make him, make his brother look like it's him. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I think Sagiri's gonna definitely be helped because like she's the person that can kind of feel e like feel others emotions the most like she's the person that like puts herself in people's shoes i feel like she knows that right now gabi mara was a tough situation bro she loves him she and, won't I, put and it i like him. the play when what's the little girl's name who has the towel i don't know her name yeah, the redhead one you're yeah about? Right. when she was talking to gabi mara i think she noticed that he doesn't remember anything because when you saw the actual the towel highlighted on him his head was black as if to say he has no memory of us. Oh, May or Mai. Mai and May. Okay. Mai and you May. could be right. I, don't know. I think it's, yeah. Yeah. it's one of those. It's Patrick's be throwing names out there. Sometimes. Nah, I'm pretty <laughs> sure it's M E I. Whatever you, that pronoun, uh, how you pronounce uh, that. I definitely call Senta uh, Tenza at the beginning of the episode. So <laughs> I was really... calling Tao Tan, bro. <laughs> I was out like Tan Tan. And then Evan was like Tao. And I'm like, <laughs> <"Word."> <laughs> why do you say it like that? <laughs> He's like, like Tao. <laughs> Sal, he drink Grand Cru, Sal. He drink Grand Cru? 
Nah, I've never had cramps before in my life. I had like Alize like a couple weeks ago. Yeah, da. Oh my god, I knew you nah, were Nah, I was at a two. Alize, you were like four. Da 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 da. Because like I went to like a two thousands like birthday party and for the two thousands birthday party, my friend was like, Hey, you should get Alize because it was a two thousand dollar ah, okay, So okay. I went and you I bought Alize. So yeah. Use a two thousands yeah. whore. <laughs> Did you mix it with Hennessy and have an incredible Hulk? Nah, yeah. that's hypnotic. Oh, that is hypnotic. Oh, that's, 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 that's how you know you are. But you know what's funny? You knew he oh, you but you too. know what's funny though? I actually did have hypnotic because somebody did bring I actually did have a Hulk because somebody did bring hypnotic. What you have? Wait, you drank Hennessy? Nah, I drank different with his other friends, bro. Yeah. My bro drink it dark. Do, you think Wait I do a that consist- minute? You think I do that consistently? That's not. Uh, I didn't say consistently. I'm just saying, yeah. hey, man. I don't know Henny Jersey. Uh, I said Henny Jersey. Who wears fat Henny. farm? <laughs> Henny Jersey wears fat. Farm. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, amazing first season of Hell's Paradise. Um, I can't wait for the next one. I know the season two is coming out. They don't have a date for it yet, but at least we know that it's coming and it won't be dropped. Mafia did an amazing job. Yep. He did this, the attack on Tiny, yep. doing Jujutsu Kaisen. Damn, you're on fire. Yeah, Sheesh. Chainsaw Man. And it is Chainsaw oh Man. Sheesh. Yeah, really, Mappa really like Perky. it. killing the anime. Uh, yeah. Mappa, right Mappa like 2000s no. Rockefeller. Ain't no writer strike at Mappa. Mm. <laughs> 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 but if it's the first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill murder and smash that subscribe button. It's your boy, Wells, the Anime King. It's your boy, Officer RT and Joe Wall. Middle school and high school used to love rock and soft folk. Love rock soft folk. You like, had like the soft lawsuits. I had a soft folk coat. I can picture Wells in a soft folk lawsuit. <laughs> They had South Paul the lawsuits. I'm pretty South sure. Paul. I remember like Averex like joints. Like I remember yeah, South Paul. What's good, man? It's your boy DC. It's the maniac with us underscore RT. And yeah, in high Sean school, John. In high school, I definitely did not in high school. I said high school. In middle school, I definitely did have Fat Farm. Fat Fubu. Patrick Arte. Averex. And that settles it at the, the round table. table.